hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Samantha, hello. First to comment on part one today. Steph, good evening. Hi, Kirsty and Claire. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Jennifer and Susie. Lisa, hello. Hi, Irene and Sue. How are we all? Have we had a good weekend and a good Sunday? Hello, 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 hello. Okay, oh. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Sylvia, Sarah Jean, Angela, Irene, Lee, um, Alison, Afton, Tricia, Stacy. Hello, hi, Anne, Tara, Kelly. I'm fine, thank you. How are you? How is everyone? Um, we are planning. Uh, Emma, I wouldn't know on the live now. If you've got a auto reply, that means I should have it here. Although, if you email within, I think it's 48 hours from your first email, you won't get another auto reply. Um, I hope that makes sense. And also, I don't do emails over the weekend. So, if you've emailed, uh, okay, so I normally do emails Monday to Friday, and I can hopefully normally reply within within 48 hours um, so if you've emailed for example potentially even from Thursday I may have not got back to you yet um, yeah potentially okay so uh, let me start off by saying um, it is hopefully a earlier finish today. We've got a lot shorter of an order list um, and I've done that purposely just because I've had a family member in hospital all weekend um, and I'm extremely tired. They are fine, they are now home, um, but yeah, I was extremely tired. <laughs> <laughs> so um yeah we've got a shorter order list today so i hope you guys can understand um yeah so that's why we've got the shorter one and i i'll wake up in a moment hopefully <laughs> i'll get a full sentence out dearie me right shall we just jump jump Shall we just jump straight in and then we'll go from there. We do have the mystery oysters back, so all oysters available. Um, so, up first is Elizabeth Lily. Elizabeth, are you here? Uh, Emma, I wouldn't know off the top of my head. Um, I don't have that information in front of me. You're not receiving email answers. Uh, so if you've if the email's been here, if the email's been sent, then you should get an email back from me in that time limit, as I explained. And Elizabeth, hello. Can you have number three? You can. Uh, and donate shelves and order the wrong chain. Could you change the 24 curve instead of the trace? Yep, that's changed for you. So number three, donate the shells. Okay, so number three. There's nothing on the back of that one. Let me get this open. It's in the events section, Karen. I didn't do a post... Uh, with the order list, I'm sorry, but yeah, it is posted in the events section. Let's go down, Elizabeth. Elizabeth. 
I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name. Um, let me open up your email. Your oyster. <laughs> oh, dear me. Thank you, Bob. So, oyster number three. There's one side and the other side and in here in your first oyster you are quadding you are quadding my lovely starting the live off with a quadding oyster let me dry this up for you so you have a pinkle a blush pink a light lavendery purple and a icy blue so let me pop them hold these up so you can see pinkle blush pink light lavendery purple and a icy blue. I hope you're happy with those, my lovely. If I pop them on the board for you as well, your pinkle is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, he's a 7.5. The pink's not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, he's a 7.5. The lavender purple's not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, He's a 7.5 and the icy blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5 as well. So I hope you're happy with those colours. Uh, you have your cage dip with those. So if we dive straight in for your cage dip, good luck my lovely. I've got a couple there I think. Okay, so you have our Easter cage. So you have a our, one of our Easter cage pendants. Uh, it is the Easter egg cage pendant. And I've popped your pink and pinkle in here because it can hold two pearls, or up to two pearls. You can just put the one single pearl in there if you'd like to. So you can actually see both of the pearls there for you. So you've got that decorated Easter egg, which is silver and coated in the colours of enamel. And then you've got the hearts cut out on both sides there, where you can see the pearls through. So what do you think to this one? Would you like to stick or would you like to twist with the Easter egg cage pendant? Twist please. Okay, not a problem. So I've taken the pearls out of there. And um, let's dive in for your twist. And you have the Ribbon of Hope cage pendant. So that's the Ribbon of Hope cage pendant. I'm going to pop your pink hole in here. And thank you, Astrid, for the stars. And there is the Ribbon of Hope with your pink hole pearl. So as you can see, it's the ribbon that goes up and around, and then the pearl sits in the bow of the ribbon at the top there. I hope you're happy with that one uh, and then you also have an additional oyster opening as well what type of oyster would you like and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells Caroline thank you for the stars my lovely and Elizabeth thank you for the stars as well very very kind guys thank you
Is that a Singapore design, Tony? If so, no. Mystery and donate. Okay, is there a certain colour that you're hoping for? So let me get this one open. Lisa, thank you for the stars as well. And let's go down. So your mystery oyster. We have a deeper pop there. And straight away, a little bit of flesh on that side, but you can see there's no pearls there. I can see that you have a watermelon. You've got a watermelon, quite a nice brighter watermelon colour there. There's no more in that one. You was looking for a dark green. Okay, so with this one, if you're not happy with the colour, I can swap him for you. So that's going to be completely up to you what you would like to do. What do you think to this one? If you would like to say if you'd like to swap for that green, I can do so. Or if you're happy with this one, that's perfect as well. If I pop him on the board for you. The watermelon is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a swap for a green dark olive forest or sea green my choice uh, I've got the sea green straight away here so if you're happy to go for a sea green let me I've popped it in there and I'll show you of course if you prefer one of the other ones uh, with the olives I don't believe we'll have any of those in so there would be a weight on the olive greens uh, I could get a forest green for you though if you're not happy with that one there I don't, Samantha, no. Invoice you for, for snap bells on the pink or blush and green. Uh, let me just have a look to see if the snap bells are in stock. Let's pin that comment. Uh, we don't have any snap bells in stock at the moment. We've got hoop fittings, lobster fittings, jump rings. Uh, would any of those be okay? Would you prefer to leave them loose? But of course I can invoice you for... Um, I can do it on the other colours as well. But yeah, it just depends on what you prefer to do. Hello, 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 welcome to everybody joining. Um, possibly, I did, I was meant to have some coming in, um, and then they didn't, so, I'll tell you what, I can make a note of it and then I'll email you if it's not... If, like if the what the weight would be if it's too long so you can write this down so 
so I will not I won't send the invoice tomorrow I'll send the invoice once that in stock if that makes sense Okay, perfect. Uh, the ready-made bracelets, no, they're not on the website yet. Uh, they will be going on the website. I'm so sorry. It's been so busy here. Uh, but no, they're already made. So that they're all, I've, all, I've made them all so they are ready. <laughs> I just need to get them on the website. Um, okay, so Lisa Bet. I hope you're happy with that and I've got that down for you Michelle thank you for the stars um, I hope then you'll be happy with everything once it arrives and that's safe over there and thank you for the donations with your shells as well Oh, bless you, Jazz. <laughs> I'll try and get them on as soon as I can. Um, up next, then. Is Heather Martin. Heather, are you here? Your bracelet, Carol, it's already packaged up, my lovely. Lisa Bet, I'm glad you're happy. Heather, hello. Uh, can you have number eight and mystery oysters keep? the shells not a problem number eight a mystery uh heather i have a message for you so the message is happy birthday mum love oscar and jacob and happy birthday heather love from lorna and the kids so that's two messages there so the first one is happy birthday mum love oscar and jacob and then happy birthday heather love from lorna and the kids so you would like a uh, number eight keep the shells and mystery voices so your number eight There's nothing on the back of that one. Let's get him open. And let's go down. So in here... There's one side and the other side. And in here, you are also quadding. You have a quadding oyster there, Heather. I hope you're happy with those. And again, let me just take the flesh off here because you'd like to keep them. Okay, so quadding with number eight. What's the theme, Samantha, today? Have I missed the theme? Now, let me dry these up for you, Heather, and we'll have a closer look. It is very similar colours to the last one. You have a pink. Actually, I'm going to say you've got... 
Mm, yeah, the pink and the pinkle. It's more of a natural pink and an icy blue. So pink, pinkle, natural pink, icy blue. I hope you're happy with those ones, Heather. If I pop them on the board for you, the more pinky one is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. The more pinky one has not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. The more natural pink is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. And the icy blue is not a 5, not a 5.5. Not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's also a 7.5 as well. So I hope you're happy with those ones. You have your cage pendant bit. So let's dive in Heather. And I think I've got one there. You have the bow and arrow cage pendant. I'm going to pop that pinky one in here. So, this is the bow and arrow cage pendant. What do you think to this one? So you've got the vines that are going around the outside, and then you can see that bow that is going up and through the center there. Would you like to stick or would you like to twist with this one? What do you think? Stick with that one, perfect. I'm glad you're happy with him. And then you also have an additional oyster opening as well. So you would like your mystery oyster there with your mystery oyster is there a certain colour that you're hoping for and you'd like to keep your shells so I'll clean them off again for you so I'm just going to get this one open and with your mystery oyster let's go down we have a lighter pop there and I can see straight away you have a beautiful, bright, quite a large and two tonal <laughs> watermelon. There's no more in that one. You're hoping for a blurple or a green. We have a two tonal watermelon. Now, if you would prefer to swap this one, you can do so. That's going to be completely up to you what you would like to do. Okay. Just clean up the shells for you, then I'll hold them up so you can have a close look and you can let me know. And if I pop him in the sand for you. What do you think to this one? He's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. Are you happy with that one, Heather? Can you just confirm? Or like I say, if you're not happy, we can swap them for you. So it's completely up to you. Keep that one perfect. 
and then you're happy with that one to go on to your jewellery. Okay, I've got that down for you. I've just wrapped up your shelves as well. So I hope you'll be happy with everything then once it arrives. And that's safe over there for you. Okay, and up next is Heidi. Heidi, are you here? Aaron? Um, I think it's time, and can I have some kitchen towel, please? Thank you. Happy with that one. Th no, Heather, you're very, very welcome. Sophie, uh, if you would like to order, you can order on our website. You'll find it in the description above. Heidi, hello. Can we have mystery? Not sure on what colours yet, but hoping for a matching pair. And you can keep the shells, of course. Okay, so you've got two openings all together. We'd like mystery oysters, and we're hoping for a matching pair. And of course, hope you'll be happy with the colours as well. Okay, so let's go down your first mystery oyster. We have a softer pop there. Ooh, and in here, oh, we're keeping the shells. Uh, you have a darker pearl there right on top. If I pop that out, and then let me have a squidge in here for you. And there's no more in that one. So you have your darker, looks like a darker silver actually. I'm just going to take the flesh off here for you. Ah, Heather, yes, of course you can. Let me hold this up so you can have a closer look. So your first colour out is a lighter brighter icy blue no <laughs> it's not it's a dark silver <laughs> that's because of the uh sorry i was reading the comments at the same time there dear me heidi you have a silver from your first oyster moving on to oyster number two we have a lighter pop there Oh, okay, so in your second oyster, you do have icy blues. <laughs> oh, you are twinning, and you're twinning with icy blue twins there. Um, now, these do look slightly different in shade, actually. One slightly brighter, one slightly lighter. <clears throat> Heidi, what do you think to these? Oh, bless you, Rita. I haven't got to your name yet, although you're not too far away. Okay, so you've got that silver and twinning icy blues. Heidi, if you're happy with these, which ones would you like on your jewellery? And if you're not happy, I can swap them for you. So the darker silver is not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6. He's a 6.5. Slightly darker icy blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. And the slightly lighter of the twins there is not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. You can, of course you can. Uh, let me just see if I can find two which are the same shade and size. I don't know if you guys can see that we do have some darker and some lighter 
sea greens obviously you're not going to get let me just see um There we go. Can you confirm? Are you happy with these ones here? They're perfect, perfect, Heidi. Brilliant, thank you very, very much. And I don't think I've um, seen you since my birthday back in February, um, but you sent me this bag. So thank you very, very, very much. I love the colours on it. Um, Heidi is the lovely lady who makes um, the bags that I use. So yes, thank you for that, and I'm glad you're happy with these colours as well. Uh, so I've wrapped up your shelves as well, and I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. And that's safe over there for you. And up next is Michelle Carr. Michelle, are you here? Oh, bless you, Heidi. No, not a problem. You're very welcome. Michelle, hello. Uh, I was informed that you had an opening later down the list as well, so I've just added them together for you. I didn't realise that. Um, so that means, just having a look through, you have two oysters off the wall. Which two numbers would you like, and would you like to keep, or would you like to donate your shells? Oh, bless you, Suzanne. Thank you for the, sh the stars there. <gasps> Two and seven and donate. Okay. <clears throat> Are there certain colours you're hoping for? So number two has a sticker on the back there. So you get a bonus gift with number two. And then number seven also has a sticker, Michelle, which means you get to pick two bonus gifts there so you get to pick a uh, chick one two or three or bunny one two or three what do you think Eek. <laughs>
chick three bunny one so chick three bunny one so in chick number three i can already see little peeper there so you have i'm just going to show you them in here now these are shavosky crystal pearls okay so these are Shavosky crystal 8 mil pearls with on 925 silver stud back earrings and they are that beautiful emerald green colour. I hope you're happy with those. And then bunny, it was bunny number one. Ooh. you have a charm now this charm has got a Shavosky crystal pearl on him and it is the lavender six mil pearl and the charm is the fish charm hopefully you can see that there with the lavender pearl on him so i hope you're happy with that bonus gift as well So let's open up your oysters. That one was number seven with the rainbow, wasn't it? And then number two with the so cute. We're opening up number two first. Let's go down. So oyster number two. There's one side and the other side. And in here you are twinning. You are twinning with coral twins there. There's no more in that one. So twinning with coral twins there and then moving on to oyster number two which is number seven there's one side and the other side and in here you have a black cherry and there's no more in that one. Michelle, I hope you're happy with these, my lovely. You've got your black cherry and twinning coral pearls. Let me hold them up so you can have a closer look. And then on the board for you, Black Cherry is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. Coral number 1 is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And Coral number 2 is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7 as well. Um, so I hope you're happy with those colours and you've got one uh, cage dip to go with those. So let's dive into your cage dip. And in here you have the rhombus cage pendant, which can actually fit all three of these pearls in. So let me just, I'm going to pop them in coral, black cherry, coral. Okay, so this is the rhombus cage pendant. So it sits flat against your chest as you're wearing it. And then it comes out in that almost diamond shape there. And you can see it's got the coral black cherry and the coral in there. What do you think to this one? Would you like to stick or would you like to twist?
Can you twist? Of course you can. Let me just take these pearls out of here. Okay, so diving in for your twist then, Michelle. And you have the family love. I, I keep calling it the family love, but I'm not sure if that is the name. Um, cage pendant. So I've popped one of your coral pearls in here. And you can see you've got the mother and child. They make a love heart there and they are hugging each other. You then got your coral that sits at the bottom, shines through, the, through beautifully. And then on the reverse side has got three hearts that make up the back of that cage pendant. So you can wear it on the reverse side as well if you would like to. So I hope you're happy with that one. You like that one, perfect. Um, and then you also have an additional oyster. Yes, you have an additional oyster opening as well. Which type of oyster would you like with your additional oyster? No, it's just the one pearl in there, Cheryl. Oh, I love that, Michelle. Thank you. Okay, so your mystery. <clears throat> Let's get him open. And let's go down. So, oh, and this one's a slight clapper that just means he's slightly open there, which means I don't need to pop him to get him open. And I can see straight away that you have one, two, and three. You have three pearls there. Let me just have a squidge as well. There's no more in that one. You have triples. You have triples, my lovely. So you've got three pearls in the one oyster. Uh, yes, if you go into cage pendants, Cheryl, there's quite a few cage pendants in there that can fit two pearls on. Or you've got the bell pendant, the cherry pendant, um, and that's just off the top of my head. So yes, there definitely is. You've got a dark purple, a sea green, and a coral. What do you think to these, Michelle? Now, if you're not happy with these, you can swap them. And of course, I will need to know which one you'd like on that item of jewellery. So dark purple, sea green and coral. So the purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. The sea green is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5 and the coral is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5 as well. Of course you can. Um, what I'll do is, if you just, if you can take a screenshot there, that way you can refer back to that if you would like to. Uh, when you email me, if you email me with your five-digit order numbers, 
and then that way I can get that all booked in for you. So I've just wrote down there that you're going to email me those over, so that's absolutely not a problem. And if you include the swaps in the email as well, I can do that for you. Okay, I'm just going to pop these on here for you. And your bonus gifts as well. Michelle, then, I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. Well, oh, you want swapped coral, but not what, sure what for. Okay, so have a think about it. Possibly, uh, if you've seen colours in the group or even on the lives, uh, we've got some pearl colours on the website. But yeah, when once there's no rush, once you've made up your mind, let me know and I can do that for you. Not a problem. No, you're very, very welcome. Okay. Up next in this evening is Retha Lemon. Retha, are you here? I'm not 100% sure what the theme is. Oh, places. I see. Mm. That tea is the perfect temperature. It's hot enough to still be hot, but it's cool enough to drink. <laughs> oh, bless you, Michelle, of course. I hope you get back to sleep. Retha Lemon, are you here? You were here a moment ago, so hopefully you're still here. Oh gosh, Sarah, I remember that game. Okay, so last call for Retha Lemon. Retha, if you are here, please type I'm invisible. Invis It'll bring your comment forward so I can see you. And... If anyone else can see Retha's comment, please comment on that comment because it will bring it forward so I can see. I'm so sorry. My, because I'm... For those of you who weren't here at the start, um, I've hardly slept the whole weekend. Uh, I had a family member in hospital, so it's just been a very uh, time. Uh, they're fine, but I'm tired, so it's almost like I can't string the sentence together. <laughs> so I'm sorry if I'm not making any sense or if I keep losing what I'm about to say. Okay, so I haven't seen her. We're going to move on. If she does come on again, we can add her in, but it will be to the end of the order list. Up next then is Kerry McIntergat. Kerry, are you here? Marie, thank you for the stars there. 
bless you guys thank you for understanding i'm fine like i said they're fine uh it's just uh, <laughs> i just need to sleep basically um which is why we've got the shorter live today and there's not as many people on the order list today so hopefully we don't have a very very late night just so i can try and uh get some sleep afterwards Oh, Kerry, hello, mystery, please donate. Not sure on the colour. Okay, so you've got one opening altogether. Let me get this open for you. Not sure on the colour. Let's go down. We have a soft pop there. Little pop on that side. And in here you have a darker pearl. You should have a confirmation email, Sophie. So your darker pearl, Kerry. You have a darker two-tonal chocolate and purple two tonal darker chocolate and purple what do you think to this one now if you're happy with this one that's perfect if you're not happy i can swap him for you so if i pop them on the board the chocolatey purple is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 he's an eight thank you for the stars sophie swap for a white of course you can Can you confirm, would you be happy with this one here? That's perfect, perfect. Okay, so Kerry, thank you for the donations with your shells and I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. And that's safe over there for you. Okay, and up next is Natalie Nags. Natalie, are you here? Natalie, hello. We'll do your oyster wall first, if that's okay. Which number would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Sophie, you'll get a confirmation order email from the website. You'll then get an opening date email from us and you'll get that through tomorrow. That will be booking you in for your live day. So it'll have the date on that email. And then if you come, it'll most likely be Tuesday's live. Um, and then you'll come on on that live and we'll open up your oysters. Yes. Number 10 and donate. Okay. Let me show you here. And there's nothing on the back of that one. 
in case if I get them open for you. And let's go down. So in here, number 10, there's one side, and the other side, and in here, one runaway, but you are quadding. You have got the four pearls in the one oyster there. There's no more in that one. So if I dry these up for you. You have a coral, a darker purple, a sunshine yellow, and a brighter icy blue. Natalie, I hope you're happy with those. And if I pop them on the board for you, you have your coral. He's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. The dark purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. The sunshine yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5 and your icy blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5 as well. So again, there they are in the sand. And then that comes with your cage pendant dip. So if we dive in for your cage pendant dip. And in here you have the lotus cage pendant just trying to decide what colour to pop in this one. I love this cage pendant. Let me just take this in here. So, this is the Lotus Flower. And your coral pearl is in the centre there. What do you think to this one? Would you like to stick or would you like to twist? please Natalie perfect I'm glad you're happy with him uh, you have an additional oyster opening as well what type of oyster would you like and are we donating those shells as well Sophie, bless you, thank you for the stars. Leanne, thank you for the stars as well. Mystery. Myth, myth, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I can hear my sentences with a random word thrown in there. I can hear it, but I can't seem to stop myself. So sorry guys, mystery Natalie, donating the shells. Is there a certain colour that you're hoping for? So if we go down, we have a lighter pop there. And in here, let's have a squidge in here. You have a coral. Uh, 
and there's no more in that one. You have a coral, my lovely. What do you think to this one? Now, of course, if you're happy with this one, that's perfect. If you're not happy, I can swap him for you. If I pop him on the board as well, he's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. Would you like a chocolate bronzy brown? I've got one of those straight away. If you'd like one of the darker chocolate browns, I can do so, I just need to pop one out. Would that one be okay or would you prefer a darker chocolatey? I'll get a darker chocolatey one out just in case, actually. Which one would you prefer, the chocolate bronze or the chocolatey chocolate? bronze please perfect that one is yours okay so Natalie then I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives thank you for the donations with your shells as well and that's safe over there for you perfect uh, and up next is Shelby Campbell. Shelby, are you here? Natalie, you're very, very welcome. You have Rita. I can add you into the end of the oyster end of the oyster list. <laughs> I can add you back into the end of the order list if you would like me to. Shelby, hello. Can you have number eleven and donate the shells? You can. So your number eleven. And you have a sticker on the back here, which means you get your bonus prize. Would you like chick number one or two, or would you like bunny number two or three? Bab, yeah. are you able, do you reckon you'd be able to get me a cup of tea? Sure. Thank you. Bunny number three. Okay, so that's this one here. And bunny number three is a pendant. Would you confirm, are you happy with the same chain length and style that you've picked for the cage pendant dip? Uh, your pendant has a bridal white pearl on him and again this is the pendant that's not on the website at the moment so it doesn't have a name but it does have those lovely zircon crystals almost in like the curves of a petal there so I'm just trying to show you it does sort of come away 
from each other so i hope you're happy with that as a bonus gift there and then going down for oyster number 11 there's one side and the other side oh perfect i'm glad you're happy and in here you have a darker chocolate bronze there's no more in that one so i hope you're happy with the color chocolate bronze let me pop him in the sand for you And then on the board as well he's not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven he's a 7.5 so i hope you're happy with that one uh, and that comes with your cage pendant dip so let's dive in And you have the Dancers Love Cage Pendant. So this is the Dancers Love Cage Pendant. Let me just hold it still. So as you can see, you've got the woman dancer coming round and this is the bottom of her dress there with the zircon crystal. And you've got the man sort of swishing her around, if you like, um, with your pearl in the centre of them both. What do you think to this one? Would you like to stick or twist please can you twist of course you can Shelby I'm just going to take your pearl out of here and then dive in for your twist and you have the oval flower cage pendant So this is the oval flower cage pendant. Now you can fit multiple pearls in this one. So if you have any pearls at home or if you get any loose ones in the future, you can add to this or of course swap them around. Uh, so as the name suggests, it is a oval shape and then you've got that, the flower design. So you've got some enamel with the red, I said it, oh, red and the green. Uh, flowers there and you've got the silver designs with flowers and leaves as well your pearl is sat at the bottom there so you can sort of see it between the vines but as you add more pearls in here you'll be able to see more colors pop through the design there i hope you're happy with that one Perfect. No, you're very, very welcome. Thank you very much for the donations with your shells as well. And I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. Thank you. Okay, and up next is Kirsty Smith. Kirsty, are you here? Thank you. <laughs> I shocked myself. Maybe I just need like a looser, I was going to say like a looser mind, if that makes sense. A tired brain to be able to say it. <laughs> we are finishing earlier tonight, Katie. We're still going to finish, like complete the order list. So we don't, we haven't set a set time on it, but I did make the order list smaller to, um, potentially have that earlier finish i'm looking for kirsty smith kirsty hello can you have number 12 of course you can 
would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells so number 12 is it not sophie i apologize Okay, donate the shells, Kirsty. Let's open up number 12. And let's go down. So, in here, there's one side and the other side. And you have a apple green and there's no more in that one Kirsty you have a apple green let me dry him up for you and if I pop him straight in the sand I hope you're happy with this color there he is in the sand and then on the board for you he's not a five not a 5.5 .5, not a six he's a 6.5 love it perfect uh you have your cage pendant dip as well so you can dive in for your cage dip i think i've got a few there okay so i'm gonna this was the one i had the other one was meant to drop back into the bag but it just dropped outside of the bag you have the woodpecker cage pendant okay so thank you you all right mm -hmm. this is the woodpecker cage pendant so as you can see you've got your uh, apple green in the breast of the woodpecker there now this one does have it's not sharp but obviously it does have the pointy nose and it does have the pointy tail so um i would say that if just to be aware of those noses and tails <laughs> Would you like to stick or would you like to twist with the woodpecker? Twist with that one, not a problem. Let me just take your pearl out of here. Okay, so diving in for your twist. And you have the dream catcher cage pendant now this is the red zircon crystal dream catcher so we've got two types of dream catcher cage pendants on the website and the only difference is the color of the zircon crystal so we've got the clear crystal and this is the red crystal as you can see now this dream catcher cage pendant can hold up to I'm gonna say around four pearls so if you've got any loose pearls at home or if you get any in the future, you can add and change to this one. Kirsty, I do hope you're happy with this, my lovely. So it's got the feathers at the bottom. You can see all the room there for the additional pearls if you would like to add them. Okay, let me pop them on here. So Kirsty, I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well. And thank you very, very much for the donations with your shells. Note you're very, very welcome. Okay, and up next. Is Caroline Rensberg. Caroline, are you here?
Caroline Rensberg, are you here? Laura, hello. Oh, bless you, Sarah. <laughs> Caroline, hello. You're on the list twice. Uh, Caroline, I don't have... That's a different... Uh, it's a different Carol, my lo Caroline, my lovely. Yeah, just double checking. It's complete different addresses and email address and everything. So you've got the same Carol R, but that's so it is a different Caroline, my lovely. So I've only got the one order for you. I hope that's correct. Uh, you've got two oysters off the wall, so you would like number six and number fourteen. Donate your shells. Okay, so number six and number 14. Number six, there's nothing on the back there. And number 14, there's also nothing on the back there. So let me get these open for you. We'll open up number six first. And let's go down so number six donating your shells there's one side and the other side and in here you are twinning and you're twinning with bright hot pink twins there let me just dry these up for you as well. So twinning with bright hot pink twins. And then moving on to oyster number two, which was oyster number 14. There's one side and the other side and oh a very very dark pearl there no not a problem Caroline not a problem at all and let me just dry this one up for you and I'll have a look at this color as well now he looks like he may be he is you have a black so black and then pink twins caroline i hope you're happy with all of those if i pop these ones on the board for you your black is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 he's a seven bright hot pink is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 not an eight he's an 8.5 the lighter of the two pinks is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5 as well. So I hope you're happy with those colours. And then you have two cage pendant dips. So we'll do your first one first. So diving in. And in here, you have the baby penguin cage pendant. I'm actually going to pop a pink in here. So this is the baby penguin cage pendant. So as you can see, it is our baby penguin there. He's got some zircon crystals for his eyes. And then he's got a little love heart in his tummy. And then that bright hot pink fills him beautifully. Sorry, Carol. <laughs> I 
what do you think to this one? Would you like to stick or would you like to twist? What do you think? And thank you for the stars. Angela, thank you for the stars as well. Love it. Stick with that one. Perfect. I think my comments stopped then because they all came through all at once. <laughs> okay, so moving on to your second cage pendant dip, which means you get to stick or twist again with this one. So diving in for your second one. And in here you have the compass cage pendant. So this is your compass cage pendant. Now I've just popped the black one in this one. So you've got a zircon crystal in the center and then it is, it doesn't have the letters of north, south, east and west. You've got a crystal on each of the points of the star and of the compass there. Caroline, would you like to stick or would you like to twist with this one? what do you think my comments are being all over the place today so i do apologize just waiting for them to come through again it's like they're coming through in fits and spurts at the moment it's like they'll stop and then they'll all come rushing through then they'll stop again this is very pretty I'm in Northamptonshire, which is in the UK. Bless you, Michelle. Can you twist? Of course you can. Okay, so pop that back in there and let's dive in for your twist. Okay, so your twist is the leaf cage pendant so this one can actually hold um, multiple pearls I'll pop a pink and a black in him so this is your leaf cage pendant I hope you're happy with this one so here he is you can see that you've got the black pearl at the top, the pink pearl at the bottom, and it's that lovely leaf shape here. Now on the reverse side of this, you can wear it on the reverse, 
it's very very open for the pearls to sort of see the pearls if you like and then you have that leaf shape in the background however it is does have a front and back so the front would definitely be that leaf design there I hope you're happy with that one then my lovely let me pop this in here so the leaf and the penguin I love it uh, I hope you're happy though thank you very very much for the donations with your shells as well and I hope then you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well my lovely And up next is Kelly Lackey. Kelly, are you here? House bunnies. Are they like, do they have, tell me more. <laughs> Kelly. Oh, bless you, Kelly, just because it's a different... Oh, no, I need to highlight it. Kelly, I've got your name here again. Bless you, you do keep telling me, and I do... It's, it's like I see it, but then I don't read it out, so I'm ever so sorry. But, Kelly, hello. Mystery donate. Okay, we'll do your mystery oyster first. We've got one opening all together. Let me get him open for you. them <laughs> and let's go down so your mystery oyster we have a softer pop there oh and in here there's your mother of pearl you have a darker deeper purple and you too caroline i'm glad you're happy there's no more in that one. So Kelly, you're starting off with a beautiful darker purple. Now, if you're not happy with this one, we can swap him for you. So that's going to be up to you what you prefer to do. Here's your purple in the sand. And then if I pop him on the board as well, He's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. What do you think to that one? Uppity ear. Oh, I love that name. <laughs> Uppity ear bunny. Love that name. Do they like come if you call them? I didn't see that Kelly of course you can swap for a silvery grey that's not a problem at all thank you uh, whoever commented on that then to bring it forward to me thank you it didn't come through to me otherwise so let me grab you out a silver and let's go down would you be happy with that silver there? I'm just going to take the purple away. Would you be happy with that silver there? So I've grabbed you a lighter silver there. If so, you also have a oyster off the wall. What number would you like and would you like to keep or would you like to donate to those shells? 
that's perfect perfect okay so your oyster off the wall as well one and donate Okay, <laughs> so number one, there's nothing in the back there, on the back there even. Oh my gosh, my grammar today as well. Hmm. Oyster number one, don't eat your shells. Let's go down. Kelly. There's one side and the other side and in here you are twinning twinning with darker pearls there there's no more in that one so you are twinning with darker chocolate twins I hope you're happy with these, Kelly. So these are your darker chocolate twins. Let me pop them on the board for you. Chocolate number one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, he's an eight. And chocolate number two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, he's an eight as well. So I hope you're happy with that colour. You have your cage pendant dip alongside those. So if we dive in. And he's come out again. You have Mr. Woodpecker cage pendant with this chocolate. Oh, I love it. Kelly, what do you think to the woodpecker? Would you like to stick or would you like to twist? Again, I will say, do keep in mind that the beak and the tail have a point on them. They're not sharp, but it is pokey. And uh, not that you should, do I mean, when you're wearing a pendant, it shouldn't be in a position to poke you anyway. But I just wanted to make you guys aware, if that makes sense. Would you like to stick or would you like to twist? Twist with that one. Okay, let me just take your pearl out of here. And let's dive in. Oh, I've got a few here, I can feel. Okay, so you have our Easter cage. So you've got the Easter egg cage. Now, this one can hold two smaller pearls. However, with this chocolate pearl, uh, because they're both eights, it only holds one of them. It wouldn't be able to fit both of these in because they're both larger pearls. I hope that makes sense. So this is a 925, they're all 925s for the cage pendants. However, this one does have the enamel on the outside of him, which gives him that color. And then he's the same design all the way around. I hope you're happy with that one as well then, Kelly. And then you've got your silver pearl as well. Oh, Caroline, bless you. Thank you for the stars. Uh, so, Kelly, I hope then you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. Thank you very, very much for the donations with your shells. No, you're very, very welcome.
Okay, up next then is Sheila Lowe. Sheila, are you here? Good night, Sophie. Thank you for joining us today. Sheila, can you have two mystery and donate your shells? Of course you can. Is there certain colours that you're hoping for? So, number one and number two. Let me get this open. And two. And let's go down. So, mystery oyster number one. We have a lighter pop there. And in oyster number one, there's a little bit of flesh there, but you can see there's no pearls on that side. I can, however, see that you have one, two, and three. One, two, three. I keep wanting to say triples, but there could be an extra one in there. So I sort of hold off and there's no more in that one. You have triples. You have a icy blue, a TARDIS blue and a gold. And then moving on to oyster number two, which again is your mystery oyster. You have a softer pop there. Ooh, and in here, there's your mother of pearl. You have a pinkle. Ooh, and he's popped out. Let me, there he is. You have a pinkle there. And then let me have a squidge here for you. and there's no more in that one. Okay, so what do you think to these? Are you happy with these colors? If you're not happy, Sheila, we can swap them for you. So that's gonna be completely up to you, my lovely. So you've got gold, TARDIS blue, icy blue, and pinkle. Can you swap the icy blue for a sea green, the TARDIS blue for a bright berry red? I'm just doing that for you. Okay, can you just confirm to me that you're happy with these? What here, my lovely? If I just take away your two blues. On the board, your pinkle's not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, he's a seven. Your sea green's not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, .5, not a seven, he's a 7.5. The red's not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven. 
Uh, he's a seven, sorry, and your gold is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, he's an eight. Were those ones okay? Very crisp, Christmas-esque, those three together, aren't they? Very happy. Can you be invoiced for two more hoop fittings? Two more. Uh, uh, yes, you can. Not a problem. Okay, that's not a problem. The, the hoop fitting will get sent through tomorrow for you, and it will go to the email address that's on the order form. So I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives, my lovely. Okay. next then is Karen Monk. Karen, are you here? No, Sheila, you're very, very welcome. Karen, hello, number five, and donate. Not a problem. So number five is this one. And with this one, you have a sticker on the back of number five. So you get to have your bonus prize as well. Would you like chick number one or two or bunny number two? Yay! <laughs> Which one would you like? So three left to choose from. Chick number one or two or bunny number two. Bunny number two. Okay, so in here you have a bonus prize of some Swarovski Crystal 925 stud earrings. Now this colour is called Dreamy Pink. So I don't know if you can see, but it's almost, uh, so it's pink, but it's almost got like this glitter sheen if you like to it because they are Swarovski crystal pearls uh, and they're on 95 stud earrings I hope you're happy with that as a bonus gift And then let's go down very iridescent exactly Karen I hope you're happy with them going down for oyster number five there's one side and the other side and in here you are twinning and you're twinning with bright hot pink twins now definitely visually these have a different size we've got one larger and one smaller in size here so let me dry these up for you
and then on the board pink number one is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 he's an eight and then eight uh Pink number two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. He's an 8.5. So they are different sizes there. I think you can definitely visually see that as well. Uh, so Karen, let's bring you back up. You've got a cage pendant dip of those. So if we go again. And in here you have the plain charm. I do have a daughter, yes, but she's not old enough. I suppose she's actually, no, her lie, she probably could do it, but she, no, she doesn't know how to do this hair. I do do it myself. Um, I was going to say she's not old enough, but I suppose if she learnt, she could do it, yeah. <laughs> okay, so this is the plane charm. So as you can see, it's a propeller aeroplane. Uh, I've popped the 8.5 pink in this one and it fills it up beautifully. What do you think? Would you like to stick or would you like to twist? Twist with that one. Let me just take your pearl out. Okay, so if we dive in, and you have, he's come out again, he's destined to go today, you have Mr. Woodpecker, Karen, I hope you're happy with Mr. Woodpecker, again I've popped your pink pearl in here, let me just show you him with his pink pink sits beautifully you loved that one oh yay Karen he is yours I hope you're happy with that let me pop this in here and then oh and the pinks go beautifully with those earrings as well so you can match them together uh, thank you for the donations change it to snake uh, we don't do a snake in that size, um, so it would be one down from that. Would that be okay? that's fine perfect okay so I've got that all down for you Karen thank you for the donations of your shells and I hope then you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well okay and up next then is Lisa Henschel Lisa are you here Karen, you're, you're very welcome. And Lisa, hello. Lisa, you have three openings altogether. What three oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells?
mystery keep the shelves different of the old card come through. Um, yes it has my lovely that's not a problem so we can do that now as well which means you've got four openings all together so mystery oysters keep your shells are there certain colors that you're hoping for number one number two number three and number four head Jason <laughs> I don't know why but yeah it's it's in my head uh Lisa sea greens and golds okay so let's go down mystery oyster number one you have a quite a louder pop there And in here you are twinning and twinning pinkles there. One and two twinning pinkles, my lovely. There's no more in that one. So again, I'm just taking the flesh off here for you. I pop them in the sand so you can have a closer look. There are your pinkle twins to start with. Then moving on to oyster number two, which again is your mystery oyster. We have a softer pop there. And in here I can see straight away you are twinning again for a second time twinning with very dark purple twins and there's no more in that one so again let me just clean the flesh up from here for you And here are your dark purple twins alongside your pinkle twins. Then moving on to mystery oyster number three. So we have a light pop there. And you're twinning for a third time, twinning with brighter purples. Now these are slightly two tonal with these twins here. And there's no more in that one. So two tonal just means they've got slightly lighter and darker areas as we go around. You've got a very purple themed opening so far, all different shades of purple. Okay, then let me dry these up as well. And then moving on to your last oyster, which again is your mystery oyster. We have a light pop there. And I can see in here, a slight peep there, if you guys can see that you have a hot pink and there's no more in that one okay so lisa what do you think to all of these 
are you happy with these if so i'll need to know which colors you'd like wear and if you're not happy i can swap them for you also if you'd like some time to think about it that's absolutely fine uh, you'll just need to pop me an email over with what colors you'd like wear if you prefer to so if i hold these up so you can have a closer look pinkle twins light purple twins dark purple twins and a hot pink if i pop them on the board the pinkle number one is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven he's a 7.5 pinkle number two is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven he's a 7.5 as well your bright purple is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 not an eight he's an 8.5 bright purple number two is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 not an eight he's also an 8.5 your dark purple number one is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 not an eight He's an 8.5, dark purple number two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. He's also an 8.5 and your bright hot pink is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, he's an eight. What do you think to those? And if you're happy, which ones would you like wear? Just wrapping up your shells for you. Pink on the charm perfect and the purple twins on the earrings swap out the really dark twins for gold can you just confirm if you're happy with those there so uh, the pinkle twins and the gold are loose the bright two-tonal purples are on the earrings and the pink on the charm. Just confirm for me if that's all correct, Lisa. fittings on the others which fittings would you like Which fittings would you like? The class ones, the lobster fittings, not a problem. I've got that down for you. The invoice for those will get sent through tomorrow and that will go to the email address that's on your order form. So Lisa, I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well. And I've popped that safe over there for you. Um, okay, good night, Melanie. Thank you for joining us today. That's one, perfect. Up next is Karen Watts. Karen, are you here?
Karen, number four and donate. Not a problem. Okay, so number four. There's nothing on the back of that one, so no stickers on there. Let me get them open for you, Karen. Okay, so let's go down. Oyster number four. There's one side and the other side, <clears throat> excuse me. And in here you are quadding. There's no more in that one. So Karen, you have an icy blue, a bright coral, a lemon yellow and a dark purple. So quadding with oyster number four. I hope you're happy with these colours. Let me pop them in here so you can have a closer look. So dark purple, lemon yellow, icy blue and coral. They do actually go quite nicely together there. It's quite spring-like with that splash darker colour as well. So your purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. Here's a 7.5. Lemon yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5. Here's a 7. The icy blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. Here's a 7.5. And your coral is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. Here's a 7.5 as well. You have your cage dip with him. So if we dive in, Karen... You have this one's oh I thought I dropped it then. This one um came out this afternoon, this evening as well. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Take a deep breath and start again. It is the plane chart um, cage. So the propeller plane. I've popped your icy blue in this one. Um because it's flying in the sky with the icy blue for the sky. That's my thinking for it anyway. Um, Karen, my lovely, what do you think to this one? Would you like to stick or would you like to twist with the plane, propeller plane cage? twist with that one Karen okay just taking your blue back out of here okay so diving in for the twist and you have the you and me cage pendant so I've popped your darker purple in here. This is the You and Me cage pendant. So overall it is a heart. And then you can see you've got the arrow going through the heart. And through the arrow are two smaller hearts with the words You and Me on them. So the hearts are popped together inside the larger heart and then you see your pearl through the center there as well i hope you're happy with that one my lovely and then of course with your four pearl quadding oyster you can swap and change those pearls around as well perfect no karen you're very very welcome Thank you for the donations with your shells and I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. Up next is Claire Riley. Claire, are you here?
Claire, could you have number nine? Your nephew Leo picked up the number. He's watching and can you keep the shells? Of course you can. Well, Leo, hello. Thank you for watching. So number nine, keep the shells. Okay, so this one has a sticker on the back. So number nine has a sticker, which means you get a bonus gift as well. So you've got two choices to pick from. You've got chick number one or chick number two. Which one would you like? Chick number one or chick number two? Okay, so that's this one here. Now, I'm not going to take these out. You have Shavosky Crystal uh, Silver, so like a dark silver 925 stud back earrings. The crystal pearls are 8mm in size, and like I said, there's that on the 925 silver stud back earrings. So that's a little bonus gift there as well so I hope you're happy with that one then let's go down for oyster number nine so in here there's one side and the other side and you are twinning twinning with blush pink twins and there's no more in that one. So twinning blush pink twins there. Claire and Leo, I hope you're happy with those. It's a good choice, I think, with number nine there. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, if I dry these up and pop them in the sand for you. Here he is in the sand. Love them, perfect Claire. I'm glad you're happy with the colour. If I pop them on the board as well. So, pink number one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, he's a seven. Pink number two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, he's a seven as well. So for your cage pendant dip, let's dive in with Leclerc. And you have Mr. Frog. I love, I don't know if he's Mr. Frog or just Frog cage pendant. I think it's Mr. Frog. Uh, so you've got Mr. Frog. Actually, possibly, can we fit both pearls in here? We can. So if they were larger pearls, you just fit the one. <clears throat> With the smaller pearls, you can fit both of them in here. Would you like to stick or twist? So they are situated sort of ones at more at the front, ones more at the back, but it sort of makes it, gives the illusion that it's um, a deeper, a wider, there we go, that's the word I was looking for, frog there. Would you, or you can just have the one pearl in him. Would you like to stick or would you like to twist with Mr. Frog?
wanted to think. Keep, please, you love him. No, you're very, very welcome. I'm glad you're happy with him. You've got your earrings as well, and I've just wrapped up your shelves. So I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives, and that is safe over there for you as well. Okay, and up next is Pauline Powell. Pauline, are you here? Oh, I love them, Caitlin. When I was younger, we used to have a pond in our garden um, and used to have frogs and fish and newts and everything in it. It was full of wildlife. I used to sit, it had like a wall on the back of it, um, which then went onto like a lawn. So I used to sit on the little, on the lawn, but with my legs over the wall, which then had like, it was like a step if you like. <clears throat> and I used to sing and then all the little frogs and toads and everyone popped their eyes above the water and I always used to think that they were coming towards um, because I was singing I loved them <laughs> it's just love I love them, bless them oh. I'm looking for Pauline Powell Pauline, are you here? <laughs> okay so Pauline if you are here please type I'm invisible it will bring your comment forward so I can see you if anybody can see Pauline please comment on that comment because it will bring it forward so I can see so last call for Pauline Powell Okay, so I'm going to pop her over here. She's just come on, we can add her in again, because it will be to the end of the order list. Up next is Trisha Rhymes. Trisha, I think I've seen you. Hopefully you're here. Trisha Rhymes, are you here? They can be fast, frogs can, can't they? They can be quite fast. But if you... if you, I think I prefer toads to frogs, actually. Yeah, prefer toads to frogs. Trisha, hello. Trisha, you have an oyster off the wall today. Which number would you like? You've got number 13 and number 15 left. And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Thirteen and oh, wrong one. Thirteen and donate. Okay, so number thirteen, and it doesn't have a sticker on the back of that one. Let me get him open for you. And let's go down. Okay, so in here. one side and the other side and in here you have a coral Trisha and there's no more in that one you have a coral my lovely let me dry him up for you 
and pop him in the sand as well. And if I pop this one on the board for you, your coral is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he is a 7. You then have your cage pendant dip, so let's dive in. And you have the rose cage pendant. So, the rose cage pendant has the zircon crystals in the center of the cage pendant and then you've got the silver detail of the outer petals if you like of that rose uh, let me just show you here there we go so that's the rose cage pendant with your coral in the center there as well Trisha would you like to stick or would you like to twist with the rose cage pendant love it stick with that one perfect trisha he is yours um i hope you'll be happy with everything then once it arrives as well and thank you very very much for the donations with your shells so my mum she um she, in her house now she has a pond but it's a different pond uh, so she has frogs and stuff as well um, and when they lay frog spawn, she takes some frog spawn, which is fine, um, not all of it, but she takes some, and then takes it to the nursery pond, so then the frog spawn can then hatch, and then they go through with the children, the different stages, so obviously the frog spawn, um, tadpoles, tadpoles growing with their legs, then going into frogs, and then they've got baby, so they've got like a wild garden, if you like, um, which the children can't go in without an adult. Um, it's all locked up and stuff. But then you've got lots of little frogs. You have to be careful where you're stepping on. It's it's lovely. It is lovely. Uh, up next is Caroline Ratcliffe. Caroline Ratcliffe, are you here? I didn't share the photo did I I need to remember so sorry this uh, weekend has been so busy with um, everything else going on out, outside of work but I will share the because my mum managed to grab a photo last week another photo should I say of um, the oyster shells in the nursery in um, that set up before the children are allowed in <laughs> so it's all very neat for now <laughs> uh, so I will share that um, in the week So I'm looking for Caroline Ratcliffe. Caroline, are you here? They are, but they're fast, aren't they, Claire? Baby frogs are fast. <laughs> Yeah, Sean, she's been working the whole way through. Uh, hours and stuff changed, but yeah, working the whole way through.
Okay, so I haven't seen Caroline, so we're going to move on. If she comes on, we can add her in again, but it will be to the end. And up next is Retha Lemon. Retha, are you here? Retha, hello. So Retha, are you happy with oyster number 15 from the wall? So number 15, there's nothing on the back there. And let's get him open. Okay, and let's go down. So oyster number 15, would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? There's one side, <clears throat> excuse me, and the other side. And in here you are quadding. And there's no more in that one. Donate the shells, perfect, thank you. So if I dry these up for you, you've got a watermelon, a coral, a sunshine yellow and a apple green. I love them. I hope you're happy with these Aretha. You've got the watermelon, coral, sunshine yellow and apple green. On the board, the apple green is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. The yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. The coral is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And the watermelon is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, you have your hoop on the watermelon. Yeah, I've got that down for you. You have your cage pendant dip as well, so let's dive in. And you have the paw print um, cage. I keep going to say charm. Paw print ch uh, cage. <laughs> I've popped the coral in this. I was going to grab the watermelon, but no, I'll show you with a colour a different colour to that watermelon is going on the hoop fitting. So this is the... Sorry, if I make it so you can see... There we go. Uh, so this is the paw print cage pendant. So there's lots of room in there for larger pearls as well. Would you like to stick or would you like to twist with the paw print wreath of my lovely... twist with that one okay so if we dive in oh i've got a few there there we go and you have the compass cage pendants this one came out earlier uh, i'm going to pop your sunshine yellow in him this sorry i keep got i've got a piece of hair that keeps tickling me uh, my eye <laughs> So this one, as you can see, has the sunshine yellow in the centre. Why do they keep going sideways now? I'll show you like this. Uh, so you've got the zircon crystal in the centre. And then instead of the letters of north, east, south and west, you've got crystals to symbolise them. And then, of course, at each point. I hope you're happy with that one, my lovely. You like that one? Perfect. You also have an additional two oyster openings as well. What two oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate 
your shells. One new new, one mystery, and donate. Okay, are there certain colours that you're hoping for? Okay, so let's go down again. Your mystery oyster. We have a deep pop there. And straight away, I can see that you've got a blush pink, my lovely, straight in there. Let me pop him out. And if we, oh, he's run backwards. I'll grab him in a second. There's no more in that one. So we have a blush pink to start with. And then moving on to new, new rainbow oyster, which is oyster number two. There's one side and the other side. And in here you have a darker pearl and there's no more in that one. So I'm just gonna dry this up for you and we can have a look at his color as well. Uh, you've got a two tonal darker purple. So it's just got lighter and darker areas as you go around the pearl. Now, Rita, are you happy with these? If you're not happy, I can swap them for you. So the car, uh, the blush pink, sorry, is not a five, not a five point five, not a six, not a six point five. He's a seven. And the two tonal purple is not a five, not a five point five, not a six, not a six point five, not a seven, not a seven point five, not an eight. He's an eight point five. Very happy, perfect. Okay, so Retha then, uh, I'll invoice you for the hoop fitting tomorrow. That will go through to the email address that's on the order form. I do hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives and that's safe over there for you thank you for the donations with your shells as well oh bless you Rita. thank you for the stars as well okay and i have just seen that caroline has come back on so caroline hello 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 uh, you have one opening all together what type of oyster would you like and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells so um, this is caroline ratcliffe Retha, you're very, very welcome. Caroline Ratcliffe, are you still here? Ah, there we go. Hello, hello, hello. Mystery and keep. Is there a certain colour you're hoping for? So let me get this one open for you. And let's go down so your mystery oyster we have a lighter pop there and in here I can see a darker pearl there my lovely 
Thank you, Bronnie. And there's no more in that one. Now I'll double check the colour of that one in just a moment. I'm just going to clean your shells up for you. Now, if you're happy with this one, that's perfect. I can pop in your jewellery for you. If you're not happy, however, I can swap him for you. So it's going to be completely up to you, my lovely, what you would like to do. So if I have a closer look at him, he is a black, I believe. So you have a black pearl. So if you can see, it's right in the centre of the sand there. What do you think to this one? Any blue. So if you prefer to swap to a blue, we can do. But of course, if you're happy with this one, that's perfect as well. So just let me know what you think. Your black is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. It was a 7, sorry. the door open and it's awfully cold now <laughs> like I've got goose pimples what do you think Caroline can you swap for a TARDIS blue of course you can let me just grab one for you you have a look here would you be happy with this one oh bless you Claire well, you're very very welcome Are you happy with that blue there that's just a piece of sand that was on him there Sorry, my comments have a little bit of a delay today, um, so I'm, I don't want to sort of rush people because I, I, it's not, it's just as the comments are. So I am just waiting for them to come through. That's perfect. Okay, perfect. Caroline, then I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. I've wrapped up your shelves as well, and they're safe over there for you. So I hope you'll be happy with everything. Uh, that has brought us to the end of the order list today. Uh, like I said, it is an earlier finish today. Um, back to normal on Tuesday, though. I hope you all have a brilliant Monday morning and start to your week. Uh, if you would like to order, if you have ordered, you'll get confirmation uh, booking in days emails tomorrow. Um, it should be all for Tuesday, potentially. I haven't seen if... Um, but most likely... You'll have an email tomorrow. <laughs> I can't guarantee, I just thought I can't guarantee that because I don't know what's, if anything's come in or what has come in. Deary me. Right, have a brilliant Monday morning. Uh, start your week and I will see you on Tuesday. Take care. Bye.